What's going on YouTube? So a couple of weeks back, uh, my stock horn went out. And so I looked into getting it repaired because I'm on the road all the time. And drivers here around Metro Detroit are really not that good. So I, I needed a horn. Um, and we tracked the splice in the wire into the steering column. So to tear that apart was several hundred dollars, and not worth it to me. So uh, I went online and started looking for other options and well I purchased a uh, horn set, an air horn set from my push cart in Arizona I believe off Amazon. It was right around 250 bucks and then to get it installed it was like 120 bucks at the local um, accessory shop. So I have two buttons here. There's a red switch right here for a compressor on. So compressor is now on and then this black switch here um, powers the, the horns. So it's a 12 volt system hooks up to the battery. Um, it has a 4 gallon 200 psi rated air tank, um, 150 psi compressor, um, and it has a pressure switch in the air tank um, to turn on at 100 psi or below and to shut off at 150 psi. So the system's automatic, I just leave the switch powered on when I'm driving, and uh, whenever I need, I press the, the black button for the horns. So I'll let it air up for a little while now. It should be pretty much fully charged, um, and then I'll give you a test of how it sounds inside the cab with all windows shut, and uh, outside the cab, underneath the truck behind the horns. Um, and I'll show you where I mounted everything. So. So, all right, so the compressor is right under here, and then the four gallon air tank is right here, mounted on the frame, not too large. Then the horns themselves are, the horns themselves are rear facing. Um, I wanted to have them front facing because there it is a directional sound um, but for the road spray and stuff like that I wanted to uh, have them rear facing so that they wouldn't accumulate too much dirt and water and stuff so um, that's probably good for air pressure I'll shut it off and let's hear what they sound like inside the cab well, pretty loud and now let's put them outside I've got to wait for a car to pass. Oh, that is my kit. They sound pretty good, I think. So, Alright, thanks. Leave a comment.